Hello friends and welcome! Thank you for joining me today for some Civilization VI Robotania! My name is Sean and when we left off it was... Uh, wait a minute, that's not right. When we left off is the end of a turn? Yeah, yeah, it was. Turn 71, 1200 BC. Let's go ahead and end that turn. And uh, once again, the turn did not actually end. Hey, look at that! We named our cities. I named my capital after myself. I don't do that very often. Weird that the spelling like here the spelling looks just fine but when you look at the tooltip it's got weird capitalization stuff does it do that here in ben lake as well no ben lake looks normal huh uh anyways the point is i uh i made a little list of uh viewers uh ben greenhagen of course was uh, uh one of the first commenters and i've got uh, some other people in here so uh we are going to uh place our third city here Newcastle upon Tyne, not quite. More like Shallow Bay, named after our friend Shallow Vids. Shallow Vids watches lots of my videos. So we are going to name this little city after him. There you go, Shallow Vids. Thank you for watching and being a part of my channel, helping it grow. Hope you enjoy this series. You've got our third city, so you've got a nice early entryway into uh, into uh, building into a great city there with uh, with your name on it. Um, what are we going to build here? Probably not a bad idea to start with a builder, right? Once again, I feel I feel like I should really know these things. You know, like back when I played uh, Civ two and Civ three and well, actually, even Civ 5, honestly. I had a pretty straightforward build queue that I didn't even have to think. Like, I knew what to build. Pretty much every time the turn came up throughout the entire game, I would know what to build. That, uh, that, that spelling thing is really bugging me. All right, much better. Okay. Uh, sorry, but that was going to drive me crazy if I had to see that out of the corner of my eye every time. Ah, C does not center on the unit. How do you center on the unit? Nope, that's not how you do it either. Ah, for crying out loud. I just need to try to stay calm here. All right, you're just going to fortify there. Thank you. I'm also interested in creating All right, so that's good. That'll be real handy because we are working because towards uh, attacking Toronto. That is our current goal. So um, iron working would be pretty handy, but I don't know if I even have iron. Let's uh, let's go ahead and grab writing because we're not going to get that. Uh, we're not going to get the uh, meeting another civilization boost. And do we have iron? Look at that. We have iron right in our main city. That is very fortunate. Uh, so that will allow us to uh, build swordsmen. So we'll definitely want to research that swordsman technology. And once we get swordsmen, we should be able to take over both these city-states pretty easily. Means sharing. All right. You. Yep, nothing down there. Okay, so we managed to get that. Uh, iron working to boost build an iron mine. Great. So we actually should be able to get the boost on that. Do I want to jump into the classical era quite yet? I think I'm actually going to try to do wheel first. I should be able to get the boost on that also. So let's pay attention here. Because uh, if I can... Uh, actually, do I even... Well, we're going to have our temple here. Alright, let's let's not get ahead of ourselves. So we'll get our temple. We'll switch this over to building a builder. And uh, there we go. Mercenaries has advanced considerably. I'm not quite sure why, but that's okay. Uh, let's see. Do I want to change? So this would allow me to boost towards settlers. Uh, this one is very valuable. The unit maintenance cost um, reduction, especially since I have quite a large army at this point. But it's not costing me too much yet. It will be costing me a lot soon. Um, might be a good time to switch to the plus one production in all cities as well. 
or reduce the cost of purchasing a tile. Well, I don't think I'm going to really be purchasing enough tiles. But we are going to be building an army quickly. I don't know, we get the option to change a lot, right? So I'd rather have the cheaper building, and then after we get them built, then start doing the, uh, start doing the cheaper maintenance. So let's stick with that for now. Uh, I guess I'll just move you here. So I was going to have you do a builder, right? I think so. Um, yeah. And uh, what do we got? I'm going to have to... Nope. But 21 turns. Well, that's a long time. Kind of tempted to just go ahead and, and, you know what? Why be tempted? Why not just do it? No, that's not really what I want to do there. That's what I want to do. So, builder's 230 gold. Let's change our production to, say, Spearman. And let's buy that tile. There we go. Alright, so over here we will produce... Holy site wouldn't be a bad idea down here either. Campus would probably be a good idea to get one of those going. Although, boy, it sure would be nice to have the campus there. And then we could put the holy site, like, right there. Let's do it. Um, and actually... Wait, did I ever get the builder that was gonna... I mean, I still have a lot of money, so... <laughs> I thought it was gonna expand into this square here. Somehow it didn't. So let's do that. And can I still buy a builder here? I can. Great. Alright. Oh, political political philosophy, really? Well, I can't not research that. And plus we're into the classical era anyways. So fantastic. Wow. That is a big, uh, big jump for us um, as far as like, uh, you know, our technological advancement is, is really moving along. Or, or social advancement, I guess, would be the correct way to put that. But you, you why would you take that path? Um, but you know what I'm trying to say here. Wait a minute. What's a colossal head? What? Plus two faith. That must be a new uh, thing for uh, <laughs> a new thing for. Uh, uh, well, I guess it's not like an upgrade or anything. Must be new since I played last. That's weird. You would think that would be like a, a, a secret, uh, or not a yeah, not a secret, but a special feature for you know, like Micronesia or something like that. Um, whatever culture would be appropriate for, uh, like an Easter Island, Polynesia probably. Um, but uh, whatever. All right, this will get us a couple of boosts here. Yep, that's what I wanted. And there's the other one that I really wanted. So that's going to be real handy for us uh, next turn. Sometimes I wonder, is it is it because of Leventa or something, maybe? Turns. Being our friends that we're allowed to build those? I go back, because they've got, like, that stone head as their, their icon, right? Is that, does that just mean, oh, that just means they're religious. All right. Uh, hmm. Oh, yeah, there we go. Leventa, unique bonus. Your builders can now make colossal head improvements. Okay, so it is a unique bonus. Interesting. I'm not quite sure how we ended up with three envoys with them. But, uh, you know, I'll take it. Um, Yerevan, what do they want? They want me to train a galley. And you want me to construct a campus. Well, I am working on constructing a campus. Strange that a military, envoy, uh, military thing wants me to do that. But, you know, okay.
So this Laventa is pretty good to stay friends with, I think. Uh, I should tr probably try to concentrate on uh, maintaining our friendship with them. Um, and let's get that uh, stone quarry. Good, another boost. Um, so, yeah, let's go ahead and build one of those... Uh, no, wait, I probably have to work it, though, right? To uh, to get the bonus points. Like, it, it, I, I'm sure that I don't just get the bonus points from... Um, how many... Sorry, I'm all over the place, but what do I need to get this... Uh, what do I need to get my... Uh, uh, to get the uh, profit... Is that just based on... Okay, 1350. Holy crap. I am not... See, this is why I don't like playing the religious game. Because I'm going to put all this effort into earning stupid faith points. And then uh, it's going to be completely worthless in the long run. <sighs> I just need to... Try to stay calm. Let's uh, let's put a plantation there. All right, I know what our next tech is going to be. Iron working, absolutely. Wow, we've gotten a lot of uh, a lot of boosts here, which is great. Let's, let's get that iron working now. Next turn, and then we'll get our uh, 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 good government going too, which will be real nice. Might even like do a military style government to start with and then switch over to a more peaceful government like, you know, I normally play a more peaceful government. Maybe switch over to that after we uh, conquer these city-states. Kind of tempted to try to build an encampment, but we only have five turns till we have an iron mine. Well, you know what? I'm going to build an encampment, actually. So, um, f as far as like food production, this is probably where I would want to put my food production. So maybe I'll put the encampment over here. But I do want to keep, if I do a... Uh, okay, so I should have these squares available for, um, uh, mer you know what I mean, the, the marina or whatever, and the, the commercial center like next to it there. So, that's not a very good spot for the encampment. This would be a good spot. But I don't want to have to spend any more money. I don't want to miss out on getting the value of those woods. This would be a good spot. Because we could still build uh, food here and food here. This is plains. Alright, so like all of these squares are good for food. So yeah, let, oh, I have to buy that tile. Shit. I don't want to buy any more tiles. Alright, let's do it here. Yeah. Not the best spot for it, but it'll it'll do. Oh, I, I, oh well, it doesn't matter. Um, Alright, so we were going to chop this forest down, help boost our uh, boost our uh, campus over there. And then we'll chop a forest down over at Sean's, Sean's Cliff. And then uh, be able to boost the uh, encampment on that one. Um, oh, uh, of course I should build whatever food or something there. So this will probably be a holy site or something. Although, I'm a little disenchanted with the whole idea of holy sites. In case you haven't hadn't noticed. Let's, um, our scout over here. Let's get in a little closer and see what's going on with, uh, Toronto. This doesn't seem like they have a too huge of an army. Hey! Vikings, of course. I'm not surprised that would be the person that we would meet. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, sure. 
Um, it's an honor to meet you. Why not? Let's exchange information. Sure, why not? Alright, where are they coming from? They're coming from the south, huh? Okay, so they probably ran into my ship up here, maybe? Or do they have a ship on my shores? I probably can't even see where their ship is. Oh well, I don't know, who cares? Alright, uh, uh, yep, sure. Okay, don't care about that. Wait a minute, what are you doing? I do not want you to move to that hex. Uh, I was going to have you chop down those trees. There we go, almost done with our thingy. Get you back home. Hey, there's the uh, Vikings. Am I going to be able to cross straight across here? I don't think I can. I think I have to go up and around. Yep, we have entered the classical era. Nice. Government. Alright, so this... This is the one that I like. I like classical republic. But I think we're going to go with autocracy. Oh. I might be better to go oligarchy, huh? You know what? Let's go oligarchy. And then we'll switch to the uh, the other one that I like here before too long. Gonna do that one, and let's get those great profit points. I still want to try to grab that religion if I can. Yes. All right. Um. So watch your back, Toronto. I am coming after you. I'm going to build a farm here. Uh, oh, my trader is done. So let's transfer him. <sighs> Which one do I want to boost? Shallow Bay or Ben Lake? Probably Shallow Bay. And I guess you can't go across. So we'll have you go up and around. I haven't... Um, done a screenshot yet, so let's get that out of the way. Alright, choose Civic. Now Military Tradition might might be a reasonable one to research. And then I'll probably want to go, yeah, let's do Games and Recreation after that. You know what? Let's let's do that one first, and then drama and poetry. Because I might be able to boost games and recreation, but I'll never get drama and poetry boosted. I don't build wonders. I probably should, but I never do. Um. So he wants open borders. I don't think so. I don't think so. Sorry, buddy. But I probably should send them an envoy. Everything has its limit. Everything has its limit. I and all cannot. Yep, good, good. So we can build swordsmen now. Let's see about trying to send them an envoy. Uh, it's delegation, yeah. Nope, okay. Well, you know. We're on, uh, we're on, uh, separate continents, so I don't think there's going to be too much problem between the two of us. Okay, so, uh, we should be able to get the boost for Celestial Navigation before too long. Let's go ahead and clean out war, uh, uh, masonry, and, uh, then I'm going to go for currency, because we're probably, well, we're not really running short on cash or anything yet, but if I keep building up my army, it's going to be a concern. Uh, so you are going to go back and forth between Sean's Cliff. Yeah, there we go. Build us a road between our two cities. Over here at Sean's Cliff, we're going to start building up some swords. Um, yeah, all right. Can uh, actually... So a barracks would give me the combat experience. And I can't, like, just buy that, can I? I don't know. I, I'm not going to build a barracks quite yet. 
I'm going to need to upgrade my uh, warriors, though. I don't remember how much that costs. My knowledge of mathematics is boosted. Good, that gives me... Uh, that met my quest for Toronto, didn't it? These poor Torontans. Oh, met me a couple of uh, city-state quests. Let's... Uh, Toronto wants so badly to be my friend. Sorry, Toronto. And do I have an envoy? Oh, I, I almost have an envoy. Next turn. All right. Uh, sorry, Toronto, but we are not going to be friends. I'll be friends with you for a few more minutes. Here's my builder. Let's go ahead and build her farm. Um, still can't go straight across there, can I? I have to go up and around. Here at Ben Lake. Good, we have our science thing built up. Can't build a swordsman because we are not directly attached to the iron, unfortunately. But I can build another spearman. Over here. Um, yeah, too early for those things. Yeah, go ahead and build your monument. That'll work. Next turn. I don't know how Zanzibar is going to feel about me attacking their neighbor. Like I said, I'm pretty sure I've never attacked a city-state. So I don't really know what to expect. How, uh, how long till Shallow Bay... You're going to expand to... Oh, oh, for the stone. Yeah, that makes sense, I guess. Okay, still going to tear down that forest. Oh, barbarians. I should go up and clear those barbarians out. Can I... So, what does it cost to upgrade? 80 gold. That is cheap. Let's get an archer up there, too. I don't really need... I'm, like, kind of going overboard on this army, but, you know. All right, so... Yerevan wants me to train a galley. You want me to recruit a great rider. Well, I'd like to recruit that, too. This would give me golden commercial districts. That's not going to do me any good at this point. Uh, I think I'm going to keep that keep trying to uh, work that faith up. That'll do. Alright. Next turn. And there will be a place for you at Odin's table. You're a disgrace. Alright, well, uh, no place for me at Odin's table. Yeah, I'm trying to go to war, buddy. I don't underrate the value of military knowledge, but if men... Sure. Um, I'm not quite sure, uh, what that, okay. So we still have our boost to production. I think that we're pretty good on that. I'm going to switch over to the unit maintenance savings now. Um, i going to leave these the same. So it's the great general points, which I don't need. That is the change though. All right. Good to go. Great. And that helps our, uh, helps our finances there quite a bit. Um, you are going up to join this army of swords people. It's not going to be too tr tricky getting into these guys, but I can only attack with one unit at a time uh, to get into that hex. So it's not. I'm not going to be able to have like a massive army Imagine attack them. A stone, erecting a column. Um, uh, Mr. Bow. So, you know, honestly, I don't even need to activate those guys and bring them forward. Um, I'm going to cut down those trees. Completes the... Uh, completed the uh, monument there. And uh, we will... Not sure what to build next. If I build another galley, it would give me an envoy with that city-state. But 
Well, you know, actually, I'm going to need the galleys to protect me from the Vikings, so I'll go ahead and build another galley. Once I start... Um, oh. Once I start uh, building uh, commercial... Or, I mean, uh, uh, the harbors. Uh, I will definitely need those galleys to protect those from attack. those Vikings want to try to cause us some problems, I will show them I am prepared to fight. Um, we don't have a monument here in Sean's Cliff yet, but I think we do have enough of an army to where uh, once we uh, clear out these barbarians, we will sweep everybody over here. And what do I need to... Uh, I need uh, like a battering ram. Nine turns to build a battering ram? Jeez. Stick with your galley. I'll have you build a battering ram. I know I wanted to get that uh, monument, but a battering ram, I think, is going to be more important to us at this time. All right. Um, you were going to grab that stone. And over here, we've got our new swordsman. Why don't you just stay there for now? And uh, I guess that's going to be it. All right, guys. Um, things are going well, and uh, I feel like uh, we have a reasonable army that we should be able to attack Toronto with, right? We've got four swordsmen. Uh, we'll have two pikemen, and then we'll have... Oh, there's another potential swordsman down here. Uh, only a couple of archers, huh? Well, we might want to get a couple more archers, because it looks like we only have two at this point. So, maybe a little more military buildup before we attack. But either way, we are looking good to get ready to attack here. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I like the way things are going. Uh, if you are enjoying this uh, series, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Why don't you leave me a comment and let me know what you think. Um, and uh, I will get... Uh, you on the list to have your name in the video. Um, I don't know if, how many cities we're going to end up, but I'll try to get people in here. I think we can start naming armies after people and stuff too. So uh, I would love to get your name in here if we can. Um, and uh, uh, thank you for subscribing. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you here real soon for the next episode. Bye!